Yo, what is going on, everybody? The Phillies hired a new president of baseball operations, Dave Dombrowski, um, just earlier today, and it's a good move um, for how the Phillies are right as of right now. They're kind of in a they're in a win now mode with Bryce, um, JT if they resign him, um, Wheeler, Nola in his prime or entering his prime, Hoskins entering his prime. You hope Kingery does something the next season. He, um, they're kind of in a win now situation. Um, <clears throat> so in terms of that, that's good because you don't bring in a guy like Dave Dombrowski to start a rebuild because he is the polar opposite of that. He loves, loves his star players. Um, he will trade the farm system for guys. He traded for Miguel Cabrera when he was in um, <clears throat> Detroit. Got Max Scherzer, David Price, Chris Sale, just to name a couple people. Um, and he loves giving up big contracts. Gave Chris Sale one, David Price one, Nathan Eovaldi one, and he gave Miggy one. And Miggy's, I think, still has three years left on it. Um, doesn't look good now for Detroit, but when he was in his prime, he was a beast. Um, so in terms of re-signing JT, we'll have to see what happens. Um, hopefully, you know... Something that crossed my mind was maybe John Middleton didn't trust Matt Klintak to, um, with his money to spend his money, even though that he went out and got Bryce. Um, so you know, hopefully, he trusts Dave to you know bring back um, DD, bring back JT, and um, the only other thing we can hope for is that he doesn't you know give away guys. Alec Bohm doesn't give Spencer Howard. Um, you want to see what you have in Micah Bell and, um, Bryson Stott. You want to see what you have in him. So, hopefully, I mean, a couple small, because that's really all this team needs. If you think about it, all this team needs is a couple small moves here and there, um, in terms of you know, the bullpen, obviously. Uh, maybe an extra starter. I mean, Eflin kind of came into his zone at the end of the season, um, Nolan Wheeler, good one-two punch. You know we got there. Vince Velasquez being bought, brought. Vince Velasquez being bought back on arbitration is a joke. Um, but obviously they need the bullpen. Kind of see him getting Hader. Um, he ho hopefully he doesn't you know give up too much for Josh Hader. But if giving up prospects to win a World Series in the next three years is what he has to do to get there, then I fully support it because winning a World Series is the ultimate goal. Um, you don't want to build a farm system if you're just going to, you know, the ultimate goal is to win the World Series. You, So I'm fine sacrificing some guys, even though I just said I'd rather not. If, if it means they're winning a World Series, I will give up guys. But if they're going to come in third in the NL East... Rather hold on to them, see what, see what they got future wise. Um, let me know what you guys thought of the signing down below in the comment section. Leave a like, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and I will see you next time. Peace.